everyone, and welcome to uh, how to install TechIt Legends and join us on our uh, public uh, community streamy server. Uh, to do that, you want to pretty much uh, just open up your uh, Chrome and uh, hold on a second. Let me just get that better there. And you're actually, I, I'm already there here, so I'll just show you from the beginning here. You're going to go to your Google. You can use Chrome, you can use Firefox, whatever you feel comfortable with. And you are going to look for a Technic Launcher. That's what you're going to need to launch this thing, guys. So here, Technic Launcher, here we come. So after that, you're going to go to this uh, Technic platform site, and you're going to choose the operating system you have. For this purpose, we are going to use a Windows. So you click on Windows, and you let it download. As you see, I've downloaded it before. It's my second time, it seems. And uh, now it'll download. So once it's finished doing that, then you want to open this, and you want to run. And you, doesn't matter the check mark, just run it. And now you're going to see it's going to start loading up here. And it's pretty simple, guys. It's pretty, pretty simple. There's just a couple of little settings you're going to have to do once you're in uh, the uh, launcher. So now you got the launcher right here. You can, uh, you know, search all different mod packs that they offer here by adding the search right here. Like, for example, if I want to look for Tekkit Classic, oops, Tekkit Classic, boom, it's right there. So I can copy that or click on that and I can install it as you see install in this corner. And that. but for this purpose, we're just going to leave it blank because I already have uh, I already have it installed. But I mean, these are the packs that I've I, I use. You know, I I frequent. I guess we can say. Uh, you want to click on Tech at Legends, and in my in my case, it says play. But it'll probably say install in your case. So just click the install here. Make sure you're logged in uh, with your credentials for Minecraft. I'm Raz39 right there, so that's fine. Uh, but one thing you want to really make sure of, guys, is you want to click this mod pack options over here. So when you open up this window here, you will have to specify a version. It might be already on recommended. You're going to switch it down to specific version, and you're going to make sure you choose 110, because that's what our server is at the moment. Um, I won't reinstall pack, but um, you'll probably install pack once you do that. So we'll leave that like that. Make sure that's set to 110, like I said. And also, you want to make sure your Java here, guys, is uh, running with a decent amount, allocated a decent amount of RAM. So in this case, I allocated 4 uh, gigabytes. You can open up and allocate what you need. Uh, I'll leave it at 4. That's fine for now. And that's pretty much it. So once that's all complete, you want to just click the button Play. It might be installed in your case, but I will kick, click Play because, uh, yeah, I already have it installed. So now we'll just let it do its fancy stuff here. And it will load itself up. And while it's doing that, we'll just pause it now, and I will be right back, guys. All right, and as you see, guys, now it is installed. So now you should have this funny-looking little page here with uh, me on one side and uh, Ice Blade uh, Blade Rage on the other side. So it's pretty much going to be unique to you guys. So whatever it is, it's fine. Uh, what you want to check for, though, is you want to make sure you have 76 mods loaded because that's pretty much what you're running. You're running a 1.710 which hopefully will be upgraded soon. Uh, but what you want to do now is you want to click a multiplayer and you want to add our server. So what we're going to do is we're going to call this Streamies uh, Tech It Legends. And the address, guys, is listed in the, the description, but it, what it is is a streamies.ddns.net. And you want to do a port 25565 and you want to click Done. And as you can see, I will ping it, and voila, you can now connect to the server, guys. Hopefully this was a lot of help, guys, and hopefully we'll see you soon in our live community. But if you realize that you can't connect, uh, you have to be whitelisted, guys, so make sure you're subscribed, and we will see you soon. Bye for now. Yeah.